Now, two people died and more than a million suffered power outages after an ice storm hit Canada's two most populated provinces ahead of a holiday weekend, bringing freezing rain and strong winds that toppled trees and weighed down power lines. Just under a million people did not have power in Quebec in about 110,000 in Ontario as of 4 p.m. Outages combined for both provinces had crossed at least 1.3 million earlier in the day. The two provinces account for more than half of Canada's total population of about 39 million. Electricity providers in both provinces were working to restore power, but repairs were expected to continue for days, meaning many Canadians could spend Easter weekend in the dark. One man was killed in Quebec when a tree fell on him. Premier of Quebec said that at a briefing, cautioning people to watch out for live wires and weakened trees. Another man died in eastern Ontario when he was struck by a falling branch, a local broadcaster reported. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, who was elected to Parliament in Montreal constituency, offered to provide federal assistance if required. Uh, I will be uh, sitting down with uh, the Premier in a couple of hours to talk about uh, anything that we can do. I know uh, the province and the City of Montreal have a tremendous amount of great teams on the ground uh, doing work. I know Quebec is, uh, is on it, uh, but we will be there to, to support as necessary. I think the most important thing is to see yet again uh, what happens in times of difficulty. Neighbours helping neighbours. If someone's got power and the other don't, uh, we see them helping out. This is going to be a, a time for us all to pull together. The, to be safe and to uh, and to make it through as we always do. Now, Montreal is among the worst hit areas in Quebec, accounting for about half of the total outages in the largely French-speaking province. It's a very difficult moment for, uh, for Montrealers, for people across the region who have been uh, hit by this ice storm. Uh, obviously, uh, the power uh, <coughs> the power being down for so many folks. Uh, they have the trees coming down, uh, hurting buildings and, and uh, cars and, and whatnot, um, is of course an ongoing concern. Hydro-Quebec was hoping to restore power of about 70% of customers by Friday midnight. An executive at the utility said in a televised briefing in the city of Ottawa, crews were expected to restore power for a large portion of some 65,000 affected customers by noon. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.